What's up guys? Hope you're all having a great day. Let's get straight to the point. How to get six pack abs. I always get asked this question. What is the secret behind abs? Is it any drugs or is it any special diet? What is it? Everyone has abs, but not everyone can see abs because their body fat percentage is too high. What is a body fat percentage? It is a percentage of your body weight that's made up of fat. You can check your body fat using skin fold calipers or a body scan. You have to get down to around 8 to 12 percentage body fat in order to see your abs. So how do you get to that low body fat? The only way you can get to that low body fat is calorie deficit diet. What is a calorie deficit diet? It is a diet where you eat less calories than your body spends as energy during the day. How do you find out how much calories you need in a day? Everybody is different. Everyone's metabolism is different. You have to find out how much you need to maintain your body weight. The only way you can do that is by tracking your food. I personally track all my foods using an app called MyFitnessPal. It's a free app. You can try that one too. Once you find out how much calories you need to maintain your body weight, you can reduce 200 to 300 calories from that one and start dieting on that number. So the next question would be, what kind of foods I need to eat in order to lose body fat? There is no magic foods out there that will help you lose body fat. You can eat McDonald's every single day but still lose body fat if you are in a calorie deficit. But make sure you eat enough protein to maintain your muscle mass during the dieting phase. There is so much misinformation out there saying that you can't eat carbs, you can't eat any sugar, you can't eat any fatty food that will make you fat. That's not true. There is no evidence behind these statements. All you need to do is calorie deficit diet. As long as you are in a calorie deficit diet, you will lose body fat. I hope you all got something out of this video and if you have any training nutrition doubts put it in the comments and I'll answer them in the next video and I hope to see you all in the next video. Thank you.